How do you buy a home as a buyer in a seller's market? Seller's market means that basically there's more buyers out there than there are homes to, to purchase on. It means that there could be more than one person riding on a home. A seller's market is not so much fun for a buyer. Hi, I'm Marnie Campbell with the Marnie Campbell Real Estate Team here in Calgary, and I'm going to give you some tips to how you as a buyer in a seller's market can be successful. First of all, you want to make sure you have a firm pre-approval with your mortgage bro broker or bank. A firm pre-approval is different than a pre-qualification, and a lot of times as a buyer, you wouldn't know the difference. So having your um, trusted real estate expert guide, look at your pre-approval to make sure it is indeed that um, is very uh, important to get started. You want to make sure that when you get your search started that you narrow it down as quickly as possible. I understand you can start broad. You may decide, oh, I don't know exactly what neighborhoods I want to live in. Um, you may even change your price point as you first look at homes and that's okay and that's normal. But you want to narrow it down as quickly as possible because by looking too broadly for too long in two different kinds of neighborhoods and even price points, you can miss sometimes what you're looking for with too many choices. So working to narrow it down as quickly as possible is a great next step. The third thing I would mention is that your deposit. You have to write a deposit on, an, on a home within 48 hours that has to be produced. And so your deposit is part of your down payment um, and normally it's a, a fairly small percentage of your down payment and it used to be relevant to the purchase price. But in a seller's market, we're finding larger down payments are more important. So you want to have access to your down payment um, at the initial part of your search process. So it's not an investment, it's hard to access. If you need to put a larger amount down to make your offer look more attractive, you do have access to those funds right away. Now keep in mind that money is fully refundable as long as you have conditions should we need to back out of the offer um, because of one of those conditions. The money is not at risk until that time. And then when you remove conditions, it just does go as part of your full down payment. Um, lastly, I can't stress enough, you need to work with a trusted expert um, as a real estate professional. You need to make sure that that person understands the market you're working in, understands you, your situation, because there are different tactics and strategies to writing in multiple offers. Um, and even the one that you wrote on last week could be different than next week. So knowing the market as it's very dynamic and changing is very important to you being successful in your search. If you have any other questions or any other tips you're looking for, if you're thinking of getting into the home buying process right now, we are always here to help.